Good morning folks. Well, I tell a lie. It's actually well into the afternoon and uh, well I'm just finishing off the last job of the day before I go home. As you can tell yesterday I obviously went out in the afternoon and got a little bit tipsy uh, but that didn't really affect me this morning so I came into work uh, just after nine o'clock and well we started to tidy the whole brewery whilst Gemma helped me get the last couple of beers out of the tank so we batched uh, we casked a batch of uh, Harrison's Pale and we finally got the Red Stroke Brown Centennial IPA out of the tank kind of smells a little bit like uh, uh, sherbet which is strange but yeah that's finally out of the tank now we're just filling these last few casks and uh, then that's going to go in the cold room and I'm going to shoot off home to get changed and I'm coming back down to the brew shed and to the brewery because we've been paid a visit this weekend by uh, Kelvin Griffiths, homebrew Griffo and, uh, and his lovely wife I think, they're married, I'm not sure, partner, whatever, Gemma and uh, yeah we're going to go out and have a bit of a meal this evening and then tomorrow we'll be back in for the presentation of Pub of the County so that's going to be a good thing and I'm going to have to be prepared and rested for that no doubt so I'm just keeping an eye on these casks filling up I don't want them to I don't want them to overflow at all uh, there we go you can see that this one is coming on nicely don't know if you can see anything in there it's probably a little bit dark uh, but I think I've got enough time to just quickly give you a tour of the brewery. You can see all the clutter has gone, all the sides have been cleaned down. We've wiped down all the work surfaces. Oh, uh, Kelvin also brought me these beers. So I'm looking forward to getting stuck into them. Maybe next week though. Uh, we've got the new cold room conditioning room 4 is fixed. So we've got the new beers going in there today. So when this is full, that will be that will be of course joining the pail. The pail's already in there at the back. But yeah, everything seems to be working in here now. So I'm pleased about that. We've got the grain and the workshop has been tidied up. And finally, if we come up here, this was without a doubt the worst messy area. And uh, well, you can tell it's been nulled. Have you ever heard of the art of nulling? Organising like things next to like things and putting them at right angles. It's a very good way of uh, getting your mind to focus on a messy workspace and organise it. So yeah, I'm happy. That's done. That's nice and clean. Just just another 15 to 20 minutes here and I'll be shooting off home so that's all we're going to do for today's vlog, just a brief one I'll try and pick up as much footage as possible tomorrow of course for the presentation get in and uh, that'll be up on YouTube uh, as and when I get around to editing it so thanks for tuning in folks I'm going to bugger off and we will see you tomorrow cheers <laughs>